Hello friends, welcome back to Jim O'Rear's Wacky World. Have you been looking for an easy, affordable, portable air pump system for your vehicle or the beach? You may want to watch this video because Vagma has this uh, very versatile air pump. It can be used for a variety of things, car tires, truck tires, uh, motorcycles, bikes, uh, floats, inflatable tents, inflatable beds, yoga balls, pretty much anything that you need inflated, this will handle it. So um, take a closer look at the benefits. This is the Vagma 50 PSI high pressure SUP air pump. It's a dual motor system, has built in cooling in it, and it's primarily really made to be a portable air system for you to take in the car with you uh, for uh, multiple purposes. Um, and uh, when you open the box, it's got the instructions. It has a little carrying bag here that you can drop everything in, as well as the unit and its accessories. And here is that unit and accessories. You'll notice that the pump and the, the cables here have, it's a variety of nozzles. I mean, you can air up pretty much anything you want to with that variety of nozzles there. Um, from uh, you know inflatables to paddle boards whatever here's the standard tire pump for cars bicycles motorcycles um, it also comes with a little packet of additional fuses and things like that in case you you blow a fuse in the unit and the dc power supply 12 volt that plugs into your cigarette lighter and uh, powers the unit up. So taking kind of an overview glance at the unit, you'll see that cooling system I mentioned right here uh, has uh, little breathing holes on the side. Um, the front has a very bright light so that you can do things in the, in the dark. Uh, we'll show you that in a moment, as well as a little multifunction control right here that controls the light and the pressure and uh, you know the vehicle type that you're gonna be airing up. The handle right here, it does move, and you'll see there's an inflatable section and a deflatable section right there on the back. Now, um, I'm gonna take this out and plug it in the car. When I plug this in, you'll notice that it's a nice little display right there, and you can shift functions. You see there's a car, there's a motorcycle, there's a bike, there's a kayak, there's a raft, and it gives you recommended inflatable settings, you know, 45 PSI, 15 PSI. Um, and if you don't want that, you can adjust it here using the plus or minus to raise or lower that PSI. And you can shift it between units too. If you don't know PSI, there are other units of measure. The front has a light on it. When you turn it on, it's very bright, so you can uh, Use it at night if you need to air things up, press it again, and it's kind of an emergency signal, but you can sit there and, uh, and leave it on flash. The display is very, very easy to read in the light. You see I'm out in the sun here, and you can see it, so uh, you can also see it good at night. I have plugged in the, the little section or the little adapter here for the, the car, and it just kind of snaps in and twists on, very, very easy, and it's ready to go. You set your pressure, push the button, and it inflates your tire. So there you go, super easy to use, very intuitive features. Um, it has a, a dual motor system, so it inflates fast. Uh, it uses you know one motor at a time, depending on the uh, what, what you're inflating and the amount of inflation you need, as well as a good cooling air system. So it allows you to blow up like three kayaks in a row. Um, most of these systems, you can only do one or, or part of one and then you gotta let it rest. But this, uh, this breathes and uses the dual uh, motor system to allow you to do that faster and better. Um, it takes about seven minutes uh, to air up a, a full paddle board, um, about 50 seconds to increase a, a, a large truck tire, about five PSI, um, about 30 seconds for a small tire. So you're looking at about you know 30 to 50 seconds per five pounds of pressure. Um, it has an auto stop function. So once you reach the pressure you've set, it just shuts off. So you don't have to worry about going over, going under, anything like that. The only drawback that really I see that this has is the 12 volt power supply. Um, my bike, for instance, has a, a USB power supply. It doesn't help me with that. It does help me in the car to plug it in. 
and the cords and cables and everything are, are long enough. They are long enough to reach from the interior of your car to get all of the tires. Um, but if you want to use it at home, you're going to need a, a different plug system. You're going to have to buy that separately to plug into the wall. Um, or it could even have also a, a battery backup, possibly, which would be helpful. You just charge it up, throw it in your vehicle and go. Use it at the beach, drag it around wherever you want. You don't have to worry about plugging it into the car. Um, but overall, a very good system. You can pick it up on sale on Amazon for about 90 bucks. So if you are interested in one of these, take a closer look online, pick one up and try it out. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. If you have, click that like button to let the powers that be know that you like the video. And while you're at it, click on follow or subscribe and you'll be notified when I upload new videos. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you next time.